is Miss Emily from LotionTutor.com and this is a nice little lesson that I have about number path and counting from a number using number paths. But before I get to this lesson, be sure to visit MotionTutor.com for other games and activities and other videos that's related to them. Okay, let's get to this lesson. Okay, looking at my tablet here. Now, remember the title of this lesson is Counting from a Number Using Number Paths. And, as you can see, we have a character here. And it is my brother, Ethan. Say hi, Ethan. Okay, Ethan is waving at us. So he's going to be part of this demonstration. So now, let me show you what I'm talking about. How many jumps does it take to go from 3 to 7? So we're going to go from 3 over here to 7. And we're going to count how many jumps it takes us to get there. So I will position Ethan at 3. And then we'll count the jumps. Let's go, Ethan. Are you ready, Ethan? It seems like Ethan is ready. Let's go. One. Two. Three. And four. So it took four jumps to get from three to seven. See? One, two, three, four. Four jumps. So that means to go from 3 to 7, it means you're going 4. You're adding 4 to 3 to get to 7. Alright, let's look at another one. How many jumps does it take to go from 2 to 8? I'll position Ethan at 2. And I think Ethan is ready. And we're going to go to 8. One, two, three, four, five, six. So it took six jumps. See? One, two, three, four, five, six. It took six jumps. To go from 2 to 8. So if someone ever asks you, 2 plus what is 8? You say 6. Because it took 6 jumps. Okay, let me reset. And... How many jumps does it take to go from 7 to 10? So, we're going to go from 7, standing on 7, you ready Ethan? And we're going to 10, 1, 2, 3, so it took 3 jumps to get from 7 to 10. See? One, two, three. That is all for now. Thank you for watching a MotionTutor.com video. Remember to check out any activities and games that are related to this video and other video lessons. Bye!